Oh my god! to pull this booster out, brake booster, and the master cylinder, and while I was there I pulled the clutch master out, because obviously the master was leaking, as you can tell from all that paint that's peeling off, but the booster was also failing, it was actually holding the brakes on, um, so there's obviously an issue in there somewhere, but as a lot of you probably know, to get those out, this is what I had to do. right through the floor where the steering column goes. Uh, you can see all that surface rust there, um, which is from that leaking master cylinder. It's obviously been leaking for a long, long time. So while I've got this out, I plan to wire wheel it, make sure there's no serious rust there. Um, obviously rust kill, give it a bit of paint just to make sure none of the rust comes back and gives me trouble in the future. So, yeah, it's turning into a bit more of a bigger job than I thought, but I think everything with this van is. But, at least once it's done, it's done. Then it's all good to go. But yeah, major surgery. off the road. I do have a lot of uh, other spares there that I plan on tracking into it. Um, also getting the dual battery system ready. A few treats in this box. I might save that for another episode though but it's pretty exciting. You'll, you'll see. But um, let's just say there's going to be a lot of technology in this van. We have got a fridge. Obviously not hooked up yet, but it is a Dometic. So I guess the plan is to hook this up, obviously. <clears throat> Have a bench across here. The bed will probably come to around about here. Somewhere around there. Um, bench here for the kitchen. Big drawer coming out there. Big drawer coming out the side here. Obviously, a bed on top of that. But I've hit a few mechanical snags. So while this thing's out of action on the hoist, I'm going to do all these front up control arm, lower control arm bushes, ball joints, uh, these brake lines obviously, they're pretty shagged. Um, yeah, and sway bar links, wheel bearings. 
I'm just going to do the lot while it's off the road. Uh, yeah, so they'll be in upcoming videos. Doesn't want to come me out. Yeah, bastard. It came off in two pieces. So I've got these calipers going off to get rebuilt, the booster going off to get rebuilt. I've got brand new master cylinders and a slave cylinder. Uh, new hoses coming, so it's all off ready to go. I've still got a bit of suspension work to do, which I have parts for, uh, but that will be for another day and another episode. So I hope you enjoyed and we'll see you on the next one. So, I have just found the squeak I've been chasing, which is great. When I popped this ball joint, um, obviously the torsion bars were undone, um, but it just, this arm just what would not move up by itself. So I've got the pry bar and found it. So now I can fix it and not have a fucking squeak on my front end, which would be great. Now I'm living with all my fears.